Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle channel. Today I'm going to be doing the latest travel news worldwide part one. So let's jump right into it. Now according to www.breakingtravelnews.com, I've got nine fantastic brand new travel facts. Um, so it's going to be all about the latest travel news which um, a lot of it is good but obviously some of it is not so good so I'm going to start off with number one and um, this isn't so good news though um, unfortunately Qantas cuts 2000 staff as ground handling is outsourced so um that's the latest airline to cut staff um it's really a shame but i really hope Qantas um gets back up and running as soon as possible um so they can employ more staff um, number two, which urges passengers to book direct with providers uh, such as TUI and or just other providers um, um, book directly um, as holidaymakers are usually better off avoiding booking sites when arranging a holiday directly with the travel provider instead according to what which it uh, says so you'd be better instead of going say on a comparison site um to just book directly say with TUI, um, Thomas Cook or um, whoever your travel provider is going to be, uh, just booking directly with them. Um, so number three, um, Accor credits new lifestyle business with any small hotels so that's really good news and that they'll be working together number four um, which is really good news Brittany Ferries welcomes Galicia to the fleet so really good news a new ferry um, coming with Brittany Ferries so good luck um, at this year and next year to Brittany Ferries. And uh, number five, Vistara to launch Mumbai Connection in January. So that's really um, good news um, for Vistar Airlines. Um, and I really hope it goes as well as possible for Mumbai and Vistara Airways. Number six, the Dilly Hotel is to launch in London, the capital of the UK, the next spring. So, 2021. So, wow, that's really exciting. I hope um, the hotel does well and um i hope in the future uh, tourism in the uk and worldwide uh, gets better in the future um when it's safe to do so however number seven is isad airlines uh, to launch a new beijing flights and um, in december 2020 so 
well done to if I dare away some Beijing I really hope it goes as well as possible for you and at number eight Abita launches a chargeback helpline to help members so um, that's really good news um, because it helps Abita travel agent members um, to get help and obviously customers as well and uh, number nine is Finair takes in-flight dining options to into supermarkets wow so the Finnish airline is taking their in-flight dining options into their supermarkets so well done Finair I hope it goes as well as possible and it boosts supermarkets and uh, Finair airlines um in the future um customers so i would like to say thank you for watching if you haven't subscribed please subscribe it's a red and white subscribe button also click the notification bell i upload at least four to six times a week this week i'm uh, going to try and upload five times a week again so i would like to say thank you for watching and everybody please stay safe i'm the next vlog um, is going to be uh, basically upcoming travel destinations part six um, so thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow thank you bye